Cosmos. Number three. Starman. There's a starman waiting in the sky by David Bowie. With every blur of light I pass, I fade, and become a part of this void of nothing, tin ship hurtling through icy depths, empty and devoid of the warmth I crave. I wonder who else might be there, and who else might find me, but so far, there is only me who seeks the help of others. It's another day, but they clump together into an uneven mess of monotony, and I sit and watch each star passing by. I swear I've seen this one a thousand times, with gold curls and waving tendrils that blind and glint off of the tin ship. I've seen her so much I've named her. Helen. She never seems to waver, only burbling with fiery licks of liquid light. I can count on her to be there. I'd let that carry me to sleep. Dark black, heavy black, I can't see or feel or breathe black. I think that Helen left. I can feel the cold in my bones, how it cracks and steals the marrow down below. No breath is without a harrowing shudder rattling the entire tin ship. The breasts themselves are sharp and bitter with a piercing pain lancing my chest. I'm waiting. I don't know for who. Maybe Helen, but she left a while ago. I think I just want someone to lay with in the void. Please. I'm waiting in the sky, but I don't know what for. I don't know why. A lonely star man, praying for someone to come and help me be not so very alone. Maybe the black holes were on to something, stretching time, melding it to themselves, taking in everyone that came. At least they weren't lonely. Maybe Helen met a black hole, danced with them, mesmerized by how dark and devoid they were, just wanting to look a little closer. She slipped into her death dance and twirled her away into nothing. I think I hear something, a -a rat-a-tat-tat in the ship. Maybe it's me, maybe it's the ship, maybe it's someone telling me I'm not alone. Night and day are one. But the way my eyes are sticky with sleep makes me wonder if it's the former all the time. I think I like the universe, but it does not like me. Goodbye, Helen. I hope you lived well. Gold light, bright light, burning through my eyes light. Everything is warm for once. I'm back with Helen. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Helen, I'm back with you. Everything is so warm. In recent news, the vessel, Helion, has disappeared from the television drones under sizzling pans. Wasn't that friend of yours working with the Helion? I shrug. I'm not ready to think about it being true. I don't think so, I respond robotically. So it's dropped, and we get on with our day. Hey, Helen, whatever happened to your one friend from college? I think I knew who they were talking about, but I wasn't ready to think about it. So I shrug and swallow my ache. Be safe, Starman. There's no Starman waiting in the sky. He wanted to come and meet us, but we left him there to die. Well, as always, dear listeners, thank you for listening. Go ahead and check out some of our other podcasts on our Instagram and YouTube if you haven't already. And I would just like to say that this episode of Random Writings was based on David Bowie's song, Starman, music and um, words included, loosely. So, yeah, thank you for listening. I'm Cosmos, and see you next time. <laughs>